Hey guys, it's your boy Jen S. Knowles here, and today I'm here playing Hogwarts Legacy. I've been looking forward to this game for ages. And also, I'm 17 now, yay! As of today. So, yay! Toggle aim mod, I want aim mod on. Toggle spell cast mod, what's that? Uh. Certain spells can be used, can use a toggle control scheme. Turn the setting on, setting on to enable this on. Hey guys, just um, future editing Jaden here. This video was actually recorded on um, Wednesday, not Tuesday, when I first got the game. So, was it? Yeah, it was Tuesday when I first got it. So I um, end up mentioning that it was my um, birthday, so I don't want you to get it confused as of day of uploading, okay? And also I've got some more, I've got um, a future, uh, some ideas for future videos. I don't know if I'm going to be uploading them on this channel. I might create a new channel for that, because it's not going to be to do with gaming. I'll probably upload the first couple on this channel and then eventually like fully move over to another channel for those videos. I'll still be sticking with gaming videos on this channel, okay? I just thought I would let you know, okay? Let's get back to the video. I'll keep the sensitivity normal for now. Audio visualizer, what? Activates or deactivates the audio visualizer. While use the which uses on screen icons to indicate audio events. Nah. No what? Text size I can keep normal. Okay, I think. That'll be fine for now. I want the extra graphic quality, come on. Oh, it's just turn color going down there. Who actually reads that stuff? Link your home for the fan club. No. Skip sign in. Just do that, I can't bother reading all of that. Finally. Also got me a can of monster. Yeah. Oh, brightness. I actually want it to be quite bright. Because I prefer it that way. I mean... I could have it to this, but... I prefer it when it's bright. Because my, um... I say it's not the best. Okay, so our uh, Hogwarts acceptance letter. We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student. Mm, yeah, kind of weird, but terms term begins on one September, or oh, as in first of September or September first. 
depending if you're Brit or not, you care. Um, <laughs> oops. If you're British or American. Because, you know, different places, yeah. Preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you on your journey to the castle. As you may be aware, the decree for the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside school. However, due to your unique circumstances, the Ministry has grace, graciously agreed to allow Professor L. Eliza Fig to help you hone your spell casting before escorting you from London to the castle to start you know, for the start of term feast and the sorting ceremony. Yours sincerely, M. Weasley. Professor Weasley, Deputy Headmistress. So she's got basically um thingy's job. McGonagall's job. Okay. That is the I believe the style for if you would want to be going for a Ginny kind of look. Hmm. Uh, none of these kind of work. I want to go for like a Hermione kind of look. How about that? Eh, not really. How about that? No. The hair's too straight. No. Because Hermione is my uh, favourite character. But I guess, you know, we can. You know, it's, I think the closest hairstyle so far we've got is actually this. Okay. No, I am trying to make her a vampire. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That will. Okay. For some reason, the glasses weren't visible. But there's Harry's glasses, Hermione's glasses, and I think. Does I can't remember. Does McGonagall wear glasses? Sometimes she. Yeah, I've definitely seen her in glasses. So there's Harry's, Dumbledore's, and McGonagall's glasses there. But I'm not going for any glasses. Okay, so now we've got to be. A, now we're able to actually perfect the hairstyle. Okay, that actually looks kind of like a mayonnaise. Hmm. Her colour. Okay. Mm. Okay, so now I've seen all the different colours. They'll be like the weird lizard if you're trying to make it like. Yeah, that complexion. Oh, freckles and moles. What? Oh, that's just complexion. I mean, in movies, you don't. I don't think you see any freckles or moles, and that's the kind of one I'm going for. It's kind of weird that none of these scars actually resemble Harry's scars, but I am not going for any scars.
Okay, I or oh, eyebrows. Well, I'm uh, what eyes? Okay, eye color. One second, I've just got to grab a picture of Hermione, of Hermione Granger real quick. I've just grabbed my phone now. They're a dark brown. Okay, what are these colours? Okay, I'm not going for any of those colours. Oh. That's... no, not that either. Okay. That one. Okay, perfect. Okay, right, let me grab that photo again. It's kind of like... No, not that. Like that, but not as wide, maybe. Um... There's none of them. Unibrow, no. Uh, come on! Guess I. Yeah, but they're too thick! Yeah, I know that her's not perfect. Her, her in the films is obviously a lot more curly towards the bottom. But, I couldn't seem to find that. Guess I'll just maybe go for the doors or doors. Cut on. I am indeed a student, but I could. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. It was wonderful. That was quite something. No, not that. A few cobwebs and some dust. It was wonderful. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Okay, that... Select the difficulty... I mean, I'm not doing it on hard since I've never played before. Let's start on just normal. Since it's based off of Mayne Granger... May as well, you know. Call it Hermione Granger. Obviously there's that. In there, yeah. Perfect. Ah. Ah. It appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a I will probably cut this up. I presume you've been So then there's less to do it, so you know, so I'll also skip the cutscene. Okay. Okay. Are you alright? <laughs> You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. Yeah, we're it's only a little hurt. Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Wigan World. Oh, I've got four of them too. Wigan World Potion, okay. What happened? Poor George. 
can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? Sir? Where are we? Where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir. If you'd like to look around a bit. Where? I would. Mrs. Fig is a web, right? This we is a Mr. Fig. Hmm. Or why? Miss Fig's grandfather or something? Come on. Hurry up so we can run. I will be doing multiple episodes on this by recording multiple today. How far did that book well, let me check. Wow, 16 minutes since I've started. Somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, yeah, which is rather rooms. close to the Hogwarts. Meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. <laughs> mind your step. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few. Oh, we've already got our Seems one. to have been lost to time. I wonder if we're rich, just like the Harry was. The castle was built by, and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. Ugh. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key. But I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. <laughs> well ahead of you, bro. But sir, well I ahead of you. Of lost magic. Miriam wanted to understand why such. <laughs> magic disappeared yeah. from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But Hurry up! Is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. True. <sighs> is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Not cold enough. We're in the Scottish oh, Highlands. Sure, center. it's cold enough. Our first bit of magic in Hogwarts Legacy. Use the camera to um, R three to select an active target. Some players prefer to select targets and move the avatar with the same stick by disabling camera relativity. Oh. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Whoa. Ah, up there. Oh, that way, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this way We're now. close now, it's just ahead. <coughs> Steady yourself. Repair.
Eight. Oh, okay, okay. I guess it's a different spell for actually repairing, like, buildings and stuff. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That portkey led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. There? <laughs> Professor Fig and I have travelled to the Porky to a remote cliffside in the Scottish Highlands. We need to explore the mysterious runes that we suspect the port key was meant to lead us to. Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Hmm. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. It's also pretty tall. But I do have to say, this game is beautiful. Hehe. <laughs> Ooh, it's just so fun to use these magic spells. At first, when I first saw the game, I was. Um, what could it be blocking? I was What's dreading. This? Oh. Professor Fig. I was dreading doing. This like every uh, this bit of the game, but come on, this is actually rather fun. How odd! Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room here? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the portkey container. <laughs> Interact with the mural. What in Merlin's name? It's gone. Godric's heart. Godric's heart. I don't believe it. Where what? How? What? Hello. Hello? Wake the hell up! <clears throat> Ahem! <clears throat> it can't be. Miss Cranger. Uh, just a moment. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> oh. We're heading down there. How many vaults are there in the vaults? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see the quite thousand. a few on way to vault number 12. As we speak, well. we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. Oh. You want to take a breath? A what? That so I'm guessing we recently enchant. found out we was a, a witch. Measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before. While we're starting with the fifth year. These are and the not back in the first year. 
Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest oh. part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Vault number... 12. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. Oh. Here we well, are. Gringotts were founded 400 years ago. Wow. When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. Really? Where's all our money? What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Oh. So, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! Wait! You scumbag! <laughs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Let me think. Unless there this must is be a something training here. exercise, but... Mm. Surely not. Perhaps. Revelio. Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Okay. Closer and try again. Uh. Oh. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to. I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw in the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. This is fun. Lumos. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. I guess we've not learned the Luma spell yet. Revelia. Hmm. Or stay close to Fig. Revelia. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Hmm. <laughs> Where isn't this like statues that yeah those when statues? The glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, yes. Sir, I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue. What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio. 
I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you huh. moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Okay, I'm getting the hang of casting these spells. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Okay, yeah, this is what we find the statue. <laughs> This way. Oh. Oh, that's where they're leading me. That glow again. Oh no. Revelio, I suppose I'm on my own this time. Lumos. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight for that. Whole triangle during particular to stun enemies with a stupefied counter attack.
Ah, oh, shoot, I need to do it loud. Are you kidding me? Oh. Yo. Wait. Is this? That was what I thought. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Sorting ceremony to get to. Oh, finally! Okay, I hear the classic Harry Potter theme. Hey, it's Hedwig. Never mind. Now that is identical to Dingo. Except that boat place. That I've never saw in the film. I don't know if it existed in books, because I'm only I'm only on the first book at the moment, but But on the prologue of this game was <clears throat> So good. Oh well, I guess I'll have, to, I'll have to wait for the rest of the game to install to play the rest of it. Okay guys, that was an awesome experience. And I'll see you guys when <coughs> the rest of it is installed. Uh, bye! <laughs>